stop take the child off the internet remove her picture as much it doesn't cost a thing put the parents pictures up who gives a darn about them they did what they did and they're both in it together i'm not saying that she knew or she don't know but their parents they're grown and i don't care about the parents i care about the child take her picture off of the internet all right this is for a lot of us mothers out there stop protecting child molesters predators and stop marrying men that love little girls because some of us know men have a certain type we sit up here and pretend like we don't know the people that we're with most of the time we get red flags showing us that hey this man like children if he cheats on you and he cheats on you with somebody 20 years younger than you he's questionable if he cheats on you and it's a man or a little boy he's questionable and furthermore he, he's not even questionable he's not someone he's supposed to be with if he sleeps with anyone that's a child looking like a child you shouldn't be with him and the same goes for men too being with women because some of them are predators too let me tell you something the next thing that bothers me is that we do not defend our victims her children defend our victims stop posting just stop posting victims on YouTube, Instagram, everywhere. If a child been molested, sexually abused, anything, you need to stop posting them. It's not right. It's really not right. And to all my Jamaican people, stop doing it. It's not cute. Y'all think it's okay to do it. Stop doing it. I understand you guys want views, but that's not the way to go about it. Stop posting these children that's victim up on the website. We, yes, we might. They might already have a channel. Their parents probably posted them before. Let, let it be. But you're going to paste their face all over. And even if... What if you're wrong? Just what if you're wrong? And even if you're right, it's not right to do it. Stop posting children faces all over the internet. Mothers, fathers, protect your children. Stop sitting around and act like you don't see what's in front of you, what's going on. Make it be a safe space for your children to come to you and say, Mom, Dad, this is what's happening to me or this is what happened to me. And not because you love someone. Do not just dismiss the argument from your child coming and say something happened to them from another parent. Especially if it's a step parent. Excuse me. Listen. Every man is not the same. Every woman is not the same. But we're all human. Things happen. Some of us are just sick and crazy. You want to sit up there and pretend like you don't know sometimes? You see it sometimes. You hear, you hear it in their voice. You can look at them, the things that they like. I'm not saying go out there and take a needle and try to pick at everything. But pay attention to your children to your spouses too if you hear something it seems not right if you start seeing something looking not looking right most of the time it's not right if a man is dating women and he's dating women looking like they're around 15 16 you don't think that's questionable and he's 34 40 or 50 that's very questionable you need to pay attention but most of all my problem is this it's with everyone all of us have a problem we sit there and we act like we blind we act like we're deaf we don't hear we don't see Sometimes it stinks so bad you can smell it. That's how bad it can get. Pay attention to your child, your children. It's not nice when a child is crying out for help and they're screaming. And you know what? When they get older, they look at you, they will hate you. They will hate you. Because you're supposed to be their protector. You're supposed to be their sanctuary, their, 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 their path where they can look and say, okay, if, I, if anyone... I could go to the one person I know I could go to and I'm going to get some form of comfort is my mother, my father. Don't let it be that you sit up here and say, okay, they look at you and say, okay, I can't go to that person. You're supposed to be their safe haven, your safe space, their safe place, their safest person they look at. Don't say, okay, that person I'm safe with. As a parent, look out for your children and mothers 
mothers be careful of who you're sleeping with because some of them are vipers they're snakes they're disgusting they're predators they're just plain old predators perverts Put your children first. Put your child first. We're sitting up here and pretending like we don't see what's happening in this world. And the most important thing before I get off this video is this. A lot of you people that's out here posting, even this one particular child, are over the internet. You guys are so wrong in so many ways. And listen, remember, when they start knocking at your doorstep, I hope. It's going to be okay for them to post your child all over the place. It's not going to be nice. Stop. Take the child off the internet. Remove her picture. As much it doesn't cost a thing. Put the parents' pictures up. Who gives a darn about them? They did what they did and they're both in it together. I'm not saying that she knew or she don't know, but their parents, they're grown. And I don't care about the parents. I care about the child. Take her picture off of the internet. And that's all I have to say.